another progress milestone has been reached on the way to completing the Kapiti Expressway. The paving crew are laying the first seal on the formed roadway between Otahanga and the new Waikanae Bridge. So what you can see behind us today is uh, the first of three applications of bitumen. Uh, we're doing our prime coat today. But before the seal can be laid, the aggregate base must be compacted and stabilised. The base course is, comes from Otaki. We specially got it manufactured and designed for this project. Otaki being a local source keeps the cartage down, so less impact on the locals with trucking on the roads. And now in the process of stabilising it, where we put um, cement, as in dry powder, on top of the base course that we've got to the right levels and then we rotary hoe that in. We direct inject water into the hoe so we're not wasting any water. And then that mixes it all together and then we put the rollers on it, compact it, put the grater on it, shape it all up. The team are using LPS technology to measure and work with great accuracy. So LPS is basically using robotic total stations. It stands for local positioning systems. We've gone with that option for accuracy over GPS. The GPS system gets you within probably 40 mils, where we're hoping to be five to 10 mils with our system. Oh, it's excellent. So user friendly, easy set up in the morning. You know, you get it set up in 20 minutes and you're into your grading and you're getting within your five mil tolerances. Yeah, it's awesome. We need to make sure that we get as much compaction into the uh, pavement layers as uh, physically possible. So the way we do that is when we start our, um, our compaction process, we get out the uh, Winstones testing team and we use a densometer to perform what they call a plateau test. So what that does is it determines the amount of vibe and static passes we need to do to achieve our target compaction. The carefully prepared road base is then coated with emulsion and gravel chip. We're using emulsions which is uh, a bitumen based product and water. It's more environmentally friendly and health and safety. We don't have the high temperatures that we do with a traditional bitumen. Uh, so it's the way the industry is going. So we're doing a what we call a prime coat seal at the moment as the first seal and then we put a full seal coat on top of that. Um, and then in certain sections we're putting og power on top of that which is a, a smooth running um, coat to keep the noise down. All of this will mean a smooth and quiet ride for expressway motorists. We're doing our best to provide a good ride to the motorists because that's going to reflect well on everybody's work who's contributed to the project. Oh yeah, it's great to work on. It's, uh, yeah, it's a great, great challenge, great project to work on, great team to work with.